researchers at Stanford University. So we're not talking about crazy people or quacks or you know anything of the sort. These are serious people doing serious things. They're looking at, at autism from a very different perspective. They found something inside the brain, overactive neurons, for those of you back taking notes, in the reticular thalamic nucleus drive autism behaviors in mice. So they decided to calm those neurons with a medication that is typically used for seizures. And not only did it calm the neurons, the mice showed improved social interaction, reduced repetitive grooming, and normalized activity. Wow. They cured autism in mice. Well, how about that? We've got something here. Now, look, when you're in mice trials, you're a fair bit away from any human trial. This is going to take a minute. But imagine what the world might look like with a successful treatment. So, you know, we all hold our breath and wait and hope for the best.